One. Your hit sounds should always sound short, bassy, or high-pitched. Sort of like the moans I make your dad do. Huh? This way you'll ensure they stand out no matter what you're listening to in the background. Crazy 800 pounds silverback What's wrong with through the tree. <laughs> Two, it's important for you to look for scenarios that increase and improve your reaction time and mouse control rather than the different categories we relate aim to. So you've probably seen this meme, right? Aim pattern isn't recognition like this meme, rather your ability to adapt to new scenarios. Therefore, you want your reaction time short and sweet, just like that one time with your girlfriend. Three, I'm a good YouTuber. Like I said, that is why I'll discourage the literal first tip I gave you. Try disabling hit sounds and relying purely on hit markers. Some people can actually get increased eye focus and stop you from relying on audio cues. Great for people with lazy eyes. Now, just like that guy in my trunk, a lot of the times we set things up and simply forget about them. It's therefore a good reminder to mess around with your monitor settings. Blur reduction, gamma, sharpness, and color are all prevalent here. 5. If you have the disgraceful honor of playing the controller ridden Apex Legends, you might actually benefit from adding floating text in Kovacs. This way you'll get more used to the idea of numbers popping in your face as you're tracking the target. This way, your girlfriend isn't the only one worried about small things popping up in her face. 6. Have you ever heard about the tip dynamic clicking increases your tracking? Yeah, neither have I. That's why I'm coming to you with this top secret information. That 1000% maybe will improve your tracking game. I can't exactly put my finger on it, but it probably has to do something with the whole tracking and then clicking. But since these are 10 short tips, I'll just cut to black. Seven. Using the previous tip, I determined that perfect hit timer is actually 0.04. Enabling float damage makes it so you can see exactly when your gun does damage. And 0.04 seems to be the most accurate hit delay. Hey, try not focusing too hard on your score or what you're doing wrong. Yeah, it's 99 to 1 on how many times you made your boyfriend orgasm, but that shouldn't stop you from improving. Try focusing on where your mouse needs to be instead of fuzzing about the things in your head. Learning to look at your aim objectively. If you're playing aim trainers just to suck in game, it could be your eyes that lack the focus rather than your hand. Try my blackout theme which increases focus and more importantly eliminates predicting video top right. 10. If you're getting bored of playing the same old playlists, but they're still working out for you, it's actually a good idea to slap on random and have some fun. This could actually switch things up and almost create a new playlist using the same old goaded scenarios.